Greetings, foolish mortals. Tis I, Cat, aka Black Moon Rose 13, here to do some art. Yay, we're doing art, not video games for a while. Maybe. Who knows? And I have a special guest. Say hello, special guest. Hello. <laughs> All my special guests, they never introduce themselves, they just say hello. Introduce yourself! Yeah, well well, well, you said say hello, and I have yet to say hello in any of the videos we've done. <laughs> really? Yeah. I always feel like Meow or Morocco holding spy crabs. Spy uh, crabs holding maracas. Yep. <laughs> hello, I am Snowshoe. I am Pyro. And they're adorable. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, doing a collab video. Look! It's the Demo Moon. Demo Moon? Demo moon. And he's making a demo something. moon is something completely different. Yes, and can be scarring or wonderful. It's a new moon. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. We are a one so form of uh, that, that. No, that wasn't me showing off Yu-Gi-Oh. Um. <laughs> We were we we're one pile of we, we're what we're, we're we're special. Indeed. Very and to special. anyone out there, if you hear a ping, I'm currently having a Doctor Who gif off with my D and D friend. If you hear people arguing in my background, well, me, family, they're evil sometimes, but wonderful. So, mm -hmm. would you would you like to explain the art? Uh. Cat here requested that Demo Man needed more love, so I came up with a theory or a headcanon that in his free time he likes to make these origami things called Lucky Stars, which are like 10 second origami projects you can do, and if you make over a thousand of them, you get a wish. That's a theory. A game theory. Thanks for liking the show. <laughs> I'm actually making lucky stars now because they're my favorite thing to make right now. Crap. And I don't have origami paper, so I can't actually, you know, make uh, other uh, We have technical difficulties. Hold on a second, people. If you hear, like, paper shredding, that's me actually shredding strips of paper for the stars. Yeah, we're back, by the way, now that we've mentioned the paper shredding. That that will be the reference. Yay. Paper stars. Ten seconds to make. Very easy. And all you need is an imagination. And paper and scissors. And a sense of being. Yeah, my pen Which... pressure wasn't working. Thanks, Wycom, for having such... Mm. Thanks, Wycom, for having such a flimsy... <laughs> A uh, flimsy USB port that makes it, you know, wireless. Mine broke, like I said before. So, no, I have to keep it plugged in all the time. I have mine plugged in ever since I bought it. It just stays plugged in so I don't lose it. It's like, where's the Wycom Where's my Wycom tablet? Oh, it's in! No, like, my, my old school gave me an XL, so it's kind of hard to lose it. <laughs> yeah. Mine also, I actually, I lost my first... I have this, okay, my computer brain setup has this weird little dish thingy, which you, you're supposed to put CD cases in, right? But, uh, I guess. But I put one- I'm on I, Mac, so. PC, baby. Anyway, but I, uh, put the my- PC, I wouldn't be constantly asking for SFM stuff. Yeah, but then I wouldn't get free art, so, you know. Very true. But while I was, uh, I put the first, my first tablet pen in there, and I thought I lost it, and I had, a, luckily, a friend of mine, uh, Kimiko, if you were watching this, thank you very much for that tablet pin. I owe you art. So she bought me a new tablet pin. Oh, nice. Well, they, they, those can be expensive. It was like, yeah, I know. It, I, I have one of the cheap... dollars for a tablet pen? Yeah, it was, like, it was one of the cheaper models, the cheaper pen models, so... I have yeah. one of the cheapest Wycom tablets. That's okay. Everyone needs to start somewhere, unless you, you know, go to a school that just gives you everything. Yeah, and then they're like, keep it. 
Oh no, I still have to pay off, pay it off. Along with my computer. And your life. Yeah, I'm a college student. And people say, why should I go to college? There's this why. Say hi, Snowshoe. <laughs> you can't send me money. <laughs> commission me, gosh dang it. Commission, mission. I am not getting any commissions. I'm so sad. It's been like a year since I've gotten my last commission. Makes you feel better? Well, yes, I have a wonderful job working at Bad Cog Studios. I love you, Bad Cog. Thank you for letting me work for your indie comic. Oh, nice. I didn't hear the total part of that. Good on you. Yeah, I'm coloring their comics now. Well, That's fun. a comic right now. I'm currently technically, as of recording, I'm technically on vacation, so I do not burn out from their comic. Thank you for that, Bad Cog. <laughs> that, that's awesome, dude. That's awesome. It's a lovely little independent comic. They're a very nice group. Um, but, uh, it's nice to, I think, they're also giving me advice on how to improve my coloring and this and that and the other thing, but it would be nice to still get commissions once in a while so I can have a little extra spending money between commission ch commissions from them, you know what I mean? Yes, I do. <laughs> like I said, it's been a year since my last commission, and I'm, uh. <laughs> I need food. I need pants. No, actually, with commissions, I don't use it to actually get stuff, because I have enough. I use commission money to commission other people, so other people have money. And then the so, circle is complete. Yeah, so it's I use my commission money as like support for other artists, and so I can get some art of my characters. Which is why I give you free drawings of the characters you want to see, so I can see the beautiful SFM work. And the beautiful artwork videos. So you can watch yep. it in non sped up time. And then you get to be my co host, so I don't have to do extra editing. Well, I still have to do extra editing. Seal, 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 seal. Seal. Art, art, art. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you know what I was really hoping you'd do? Because whenever you said you were going to clip in a seal, I was really hoping it'd be like one of the pop screen things. Like each time I went art, you just see a seal pop up and then go away. <laughs> I can't. I couldn't do that. <laughs> I couldn't do that with the uh, video editor I had back then. This it's the old version of the video editor I currently have, and I'm still learning how to work the new video editor, which okay. I started learning how to edit with that one, and it's still finicky. I, I just love though. Like as soon as I just constantly kept saying art, we both kept saying art. It was just the seal sliding across the screen. <laughs> By the way, the video we are talking about is medic is cold again. Coast yeah. Angst, I... <laughs> You know it's featuring me if we're talking, and most likely my art is on the screen. <laughs> yeah, well, that one didn't have your art. It had Jealousy Blood's art on it. Yeah. Oh, they, they have amazing art. Yes, they do. It's such cute art. It's adorable. And I'm so glad that they said, yes, you can practice with it. I'm like, thank you. I am really, like, I really love how they draw them, because I love how Medic's hair is, like, way, way, like, he has a giant forehead on that one. Not, yeah bagging on the art i'm just saying i love how they can do that and make it look good yeah i like what with mine it's i finally figured out like the head difference to the shoulders because i'm actually trying to draw more realistically now because the job i'm going for you're going to go as a nude artist that's an no. artist who's naked <laughs> no <laughs> no i think people would prefer to keep their eyes um <laughs> But no, um, I'm hoping to, uh, I'm trying to draw more realistically so I can be a facial recognitions person for CSI. The yeah, basically. Oh, but you can't draw. This is what they would look like in a bush in an anime. <laughs> I want to learn how to draw realistically and this be my side thing because I'm teaching myself how to draw more realistic like. I actually drew one of my characters more realistic, and she turned- it was Yuna. Uh, she turned out really well, except I realized the nose wasn't long enough. <laughs> yeah. Well, at least no. it's better than uh, the other- she... at least it's better than some people who suggest for side projects. Why don't you draw caricatures at- at fairs? Ugh. Art- art is just- oh no, caricatures would be fun. Yeah, they're fun, but it's like- I feel like if you're doing the whole caricature thing, you have to follow- the art style of the caricature and not your own caricature art style, you know what I mean? Ah, no, bump that. Yeah. Or like some people expect their art to be drawn this way, and then when you show the caricature, they're all like, What the hell is this? It's a caricature. 
in my own art style. Why am I riding a lizard? It's a caricature. Of you riding a lizard. <laughs> Pretty much. Although the only problem is if I started doing caricatures, and you know how they do this, they have the sample art, and they usually like pick like famous people, like like Thor or Superman and all that jazz. It's yeah. gonna be all like TF2, TF2. <laughs> TF2, TF2, sniper, 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 sniper. Why sniper? Why is that man, Australian man in a thaw, in a speedo with an Australian flag on it? It's concept art? Question. It's uh, concept stuff. This isn't appropriate for little children to look at. Lady, you just let that little kid go in a haunted house that's just meant for seventeen and up. You really gonna barge on me dude, for this? Dude, can I can I tell you a funny story here? Yes. And, my goodness, it was... Because, you know, I went to the last convention as May, right? Yes. And the whole body pillow situation? Yes. That, that beautiful situation that, that made me so happy. Made so many... I literally had, like, three people keel over in laughter and stop breathing because of it. It was really funny. You know you did a good funny cosplay when you have people dying. Yeah. I'm actually going to be trying to get... Um, I'm going to grow out my hair again, and I'm going to get, like, s snowflake pajamas. Aww. And I'm going to carry around the body pillow again, and I'll be like, bedtime May. <laughs> but, um, one thing that happened that I kind of stopped caring about halfway through the convention was that people were bringing their little kids to the convention. And that's dangerous enough as it is. Yeah, it is. Because they're going to they're gonna see some wonderful either male people in Sailor Moon costumes, and they don't shave, which it just makes it funnier, by the way. It does. Well, no stripper deadpool which we get every single year it's like it's not a it's not a convention until you get a stripper deadpool oh yeah stripper I mean, deadpool my little pony deadpool no no we have the best parade we have a parade every single year it even happened this year we were, we were so sad if it wasn't going to happen and it happened it's an hour long hour long to two hour long parade of all the deadpools who drag every other cosplayer into it being led by the three Jesuses that always come to the convention. Why is there always three Jesuses? We don't know, and they're always the same guys. <laughs> Why does the fourth Jesus come? He'll be at the front of the parade, too. It's literally called the Jesus Deadpool Parade. <laughs> Your conventions are way funner than mine. Oh, yeah. It's, it's small, but it's great. But, um, back to the body pillow story. Um... I would start like flipping around the pillow to hide it from kids. Mm. They wouldn't. There was like no back. It was like plain in the back. It was just white. Mm -hmm. And <laughs> there was this one person that I flipped it around, and it was the dad. And he just looked at me, shook his head. He's like, "They've been to the convention. Don't worry about hiding it. Hiding it. <laughs> if parents get offended, it's their fault for bringing them here." <laughs> Thanks, father of a child. And then I just stopped caring. Yeah. And just kept the Hanzo, and parents would give me a dirty look, and I'd be like, hey, you brought them here. Mm -hmm. Sorry, I babbled on there for a little bit. No, it's okay. Give me time to snack. <laughs> give me time to I eat. noticed that the thing wasn't moving. Yeah, I was just like, okay, she's gonna talk for a while, let me eat. <laughs> I was getting hungry. It's alright, I'm just making stars. Anyway, I have an Overwatch cosplay story. Woo! Go! Anyway, since I went to Megacon last year, this year, whatever, recently, there was, like, there were a bunch of uh, cosplayers for, uh, the one in the mech! Diva. Diva. I can't know, I don't know her name, I don't play Overwatch. Um, but, like, there were a bunch of Diva cosplayers, but none of them have their, uh, they don't have the mech, they're in just in the one suit, right? Yeah. But I would go up to them and ask, because there's a weapons check. There's a massive uh, props check at our convention. Oh, yeah. It's massive. And if you don't then, get weapons checked, you'll you'll get killed by security in any convention. Oh, yeah. But it's like a massive props check. Massive. And it's like super strict, too. Even if you're weapon, even if you're prop, like, I knew uh, the, uh, the uh, convention last year, uh, the before this one. There was a guy who was cosplaying as uh, David Bowie from The Labyrinth. Oh my gosh. It was elegant. It was on point. It was pro it was the outfit he wears during the uh, dance sequence. Oh, really? Yeah, the, the, the ballroom dance scene where he has the mask. In 
and everything. Oh, wow. That's the, I want to see a picture of that. I have a picture of that. My, my first drawing I ever got from a convention, I'm not joking, I have it hung up my wall right over there, is a David Bowie picture. <laughs> yes, I have the it's picture. It's a character the Goblin King. I mean, yeah, the guy doesn't fit the David Bowie body shape, but it's still good. No, no, because it's the confidence of the thing. It's great. No, let me see. Oh, no, wait, this is the wrong convention. Be sure to blur his face out. <laughs> I think he's wearing the mask when I took the picture. Okay. Oh, there's the traditional Danny Phantom. Uh, there it is. Oh, oh my gosh, that's amazing. Yeah. But he had to, his mom had, but a security guy points at his mask and points to him, and his mom takes the mask because he was talking to me, and we were in the middle of a conversation, but his mom was with him, and she just takes the mask and goes through weapons check to get his mask because of the horns. Check to oh, make yeah. sure they weren't dangerous. I was like, oh, come on. I got a weapons check story if you'd like to hear it. But no, no, no. I have a I I'm not done with my race, my diva story. No good. I just just mentioned it. But like, but like. Oh yeah, have fun with those stars. I hate you for it. But um, no. But I would go to every diva cosplayer and be like, so uh, let me guess, your bro, your mech wasn't allowed through weapons check, and they were like, I know, it was so unfair. <laughs> <laughs> Some would actually get it, and others were like, wait, I'm confused. And then one little girl was like, I know, and dad wouldn't sneak it in for me. 76. <laughs> what? 76 is considered the dad of Overwatch. He's the I, guy with the white hair and the red visor. Yeah, the one that if they do art pictures of him young, I'm sitting here going, is the 76 Captain America or the blonde guy from Dream Daddy? All three. <laughs> <laughs> it's all three until further stated. Yep. Oh, blonde Oh, goodness. No, he's not Joseph. Never mind. <laughs> Oh god, I'm st okay. As I, I Joseph do, is the blonde guy. <laughs> yeah, I do love Dream Daddy. I do like Dream Daddy. Damien oh, is my baby. Craig, 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 Craig. Which one's Craig? Craig is the black-haired one, the Asian. Oh yeah, he's adorable too. I love him. Him and his baby him. River. I love Damien. I love um. I I love the music on crap. I can't. The problem Matt. is I can't remember their names. I'm bad with names. Matt. Matt. I don't know. I have this weird thing with, a. Uh, I call him Mr. Muffin. I Also known as the bear. Oh, uh, Brian. Yeah, I have this weird love-hate thing with him. You literally just had to say bear, and I knew what you were talking about. Yeah. Uh, gay, ter gay man terminology. Love yep. him. By the way, if you don't like the talking about Dream Daddy... <laughs> <laughs> Click this button to skip his skip time. Don't make me have to put one of those in. Never mind. <laughs> Just have the time button then red X over it. <laughs> that means like for editing for me. Well. But no, but um, like I like him, but there's like that whole competitive nature thing, and I'm like, <laughs> yeah, no, I think that's why they get turned off from him. Yeah. But um. But I yeah. still like him. That's a weapons check. Yeah, it's just like the weapons checks are pains in the butt. Although Actually, our convention doesn't do weapons checks much. Lucky. I mean, we do, but I never, I'm never a character, I'm, I'm never a character that brings in a weapon. Unless a body pillow is a, we in a, a weapon, and they never told me. I once saw a guy who was doing a full-on cosplay of Punisher. Nice. And when he was weapons checked, and we're talking comic book Punisher, not Netflix yeah. com Punisher. I'm telling the audience. So he's like, okay, and he's like, every weapon, and he goes, every weapon? And he goes, yep. And he pulls out the gun, the gun. He goes, one second, not done. Lifts his pant leg, had fake tiny mini guns on it, fake tiny pistols on his le pant leg. And I'm like, how many guns do you have? And he goes, I have to be accurate to my character. <laughs> yep. Yep. I'm like, I'm it's like Reaper. Die, 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 I die. Reaper would be there forever because he just never runs out of guns. Yeah. But it was just like so weird seeing this Punisher cosplayer having to go through this whole hell. Because there's a process. Like they have to check to see if it has an orange tip. And if it doesn't have an orange tip, they have to put it on. And then they have to put this weird little strappy thingy on the pistol part. And I was like, oh my god. I say our our convention, the way we know it's a, an okay weapon is that they'll put a piece of white duct tape at the bottom of it. They won't put the orange thing on the gun because they know like we know it's not a real gun. 
like, and my mom goes, is this why you've never done TF2 cosplay? Yeah, mom, this might be one of the reasons. I would be Pyro. I would definitely be my Pyro, but the problem is heat. Yeah. I'm like, mom, you really don't, because my mom's like, do you like Pyro? I'm like, you want me to play Pyro and TF2? No, 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 no. And then mom's like, what about Medic? You love him to death. No, 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 no. This weather? No, no. It's the weather. It's always the weather. It's always the weather. That's like, that shows on commitment. No, that shows me preventing heat stroke. But, um, I feel our, sorry. Conventions, our convention's, um, weapon check got so lenient because it used to be uber strict when we were in the hotels. But now we're actually in convention centers. They're like, we know. You're, you're good people. You're good people. You're not idiots who are going to shoot up the area. Yeah. The hotels don't allow us in there anymore, by the way. Let me guess. Homestucks, gray paint, and did not put on sealant. Drunk, drunk people. Drunk people. That was my second guess. It was the drunk people. Um, where, no, the homestuck spray paint is actually, we're pretty good about that. We know how to cake that on and not let it smudge anything. Seal it. Seal it everywhere. Oh, yeah. That's what I did. I, I cosplayed as the radio. Yeah. But, um, whenever we were in the hotel, my goodness, I was Sora as my first cosplay from Kingdom Hearts. Ah. I had to take the Mickey Mouse keychain that is on the keyblade off because it was metal. Oh, yeah. And I had made my key. I was so proud. It was the first weapon I ever made was keyblade. Is was my keyblade. I made it from scratch. I went to Home Depot. <laughs> I got piping. I got like fifteen rolls of duct tape, and I made this thing out of foam. <laughs> it was so good. It, it until it broke like uh, uh, last year, and I had to throw it away. Aww. But yeah, that's that's all that my weapons check story is because. I don't ever be a character that needs weapons check. Yeah. I mean, I'm either debating on going as Sal or Sally Face from the game Sally Face. What's that? Exactly. No one seems to know what that is. Um, it's a game that's still in development. It's just an extremely simple cosplay because I'm hoping to open up a booth next year. Yeah. Um... Or I'm going to be going... I know I'm going to be going as May. But... Or I'm going to try to attempt Rose Quartz from uh, Steven Universe. Yes! Did I tell you about the guy who did it, who was Rose Quartz and he was in drag? No, but I'm pretty sure it was amazing because people who do drag tend to be like the bosses at cosplay. Yes, they are. There was this... this my first time ever going to Megacon, uh, there was a guy who did Jinx from League's, League of Legends. Picture here. Maybe. <laughs> If I even remember. It and, looks awesome. Yeah. But I was like, I didn't know it was a chick. I didn't know it was a dude. And I was taking the picture and I was like, thanks. And he, and the person goes, sure, whatever. And I'm like, that, those are the best cosplays. Yeah. And I just stand best there. And I'm like, whenever you can't tell their age or their gender. Yeah. And I just stand there and I go. And he goes, yes, I'm a dude. <laughs> and I go, no, no, no. I'm not freaked out by that. I'm just really impressed. And it also makes sense because League of because because <laughs> Jinx is super tiny. She's practically oh, yeah. a boy body. I was also very impressed how well he did his weapon. So <laughs> that was what I was just like. And I remember like one time I was at a MegaCon. Uh, bunch of steven universe cosplayers and i was just like i want to hug you wait who sealed and who did it <laughs> i remember the homestuck kebab i remember homestuck who sealed <laughs> oh goodness <laughs> and they're like former homestuck you i remember to seal and i was like i'm hugging you then <laughs> oh homestuck it taught us some stuff well, Tana has a lot of stuff. Seriously, people, read the comic. Read it! Uh, skip the first three chapters. There's literally nothing in it. No, no, read the first three chapters. No, they're boring. <laughs> read the first three chapters. Don't listen to Snowshoe. She know nothing. I know everything. Really? Yes. What is Scout's shoe size? 
No Googling. <laughs> I'm just staring at the screen awkwardly. Hold on. <laughs> Nine and a half. Six and a half. Holy crap, he has small feet. Well, they're runners! And? Runners have tiny feet. <laughs> what? I mean, I know it was literally the runt of the litter, but wow. <laughs> Do you really want to hurt Scout's feelings even further? No. No. I'm okay with doing it, but no. Just for that, you have to hug the Scout bunny. If it's a red scout, I don't care about insulting it. If it's a blue scout, I feel bad. What if it's just a bunny with a scout hat on it and we don't know what if, if it's red or blue? I'll still hug it. Thank you. Because <laughs> I am team blue. I is team whatever. I is team bacon. <laughs> I like blue mainly because it's my favorite color. <laughs> gonna be like bluest but then i remember i'm on team mystic in pokemon go blue i mean i'll be red if i have to be i don't mind being team red red's cool i'm still snowshoe but i like blue the snowiest of shoes nice and cold and wet wait wet well, like frozen really oh did you see the video that came out of the uh, preview of uh frozen the uh, broadway musical nope because i don't care about that stuff I know, you don't. But I sat here going, okay, minus as much as I do not like Frozen and do not see the point of the musical, the costume change between the one dress and the other looked pretty interesting. I, although, mind you, the one video that came, that showed of it was, like, super bad quality cell phone footage. I'm like, seriously, you can do HD, HD on a phone now. Why is it so crap? You know what I mean? Yeah. I can do HD on my Android. Video sponsored by Android. It's not sponsored by Android. We're, we're sponsored by Saxton Hale now. Yes. So um, we have to now be more rugged and manly and Australian. So uh, grow that mustache. <sighs> No comment. Did you grow a mustache? No. Just no comment. <laughs> Ouch. Did you hurt yourself? My no. My, I went to the gym like four days ago and my arms still hurt. <laughs> See, this is why I don't go to the gym. I go to the gym because I have to, like, get in... <laughs> Are you, are you trying to get in shape? Because this is where I'm going to tell you round is a shape. No, I know. But I'm just trying to... Not get in shape, but more like... Be more fit. Yeah. Look, it's a hand. By the way... What? The one part right there that you have highlighted, that's his arm, that's not an arm. <laughs> I was testing you. Thank you. You get one cookie. Thank you. Made out of now chest. I two cookies. Did you eat your first cookie? No. Why not? Because the more cookies I get, the more I get to enjoy at one time. But, but, bacon bits. I don't know. <laughs> he looks so happy. His tongue is sticking out. He's, what do you think? Ah, he's you didn't notice it. You didn't notice it. That's why he's very subtle and tiny. What? There it is. <laughs> what? The only little part of his hand next to the star that he's holding. I noticed it. I now noticed it. Okay, okay. I've noticed it. Look, I'm coloring it. See? Color. <laughs> <sighs> Snowshoe is my second eye. Third eye. Is this a demo man joke? What? <laughs> yes, it's a demo man joke. Aye. We've been making eye puns all day now. 
We were making them and not realizing them. Yeah, I I is one of my popular ones. See, technically, he's part of my heritage now that I think about it. Why? Because I'm Scottish. So am I. Cool. Demo man dad. Demo dad! Demo Oh, gosh. <laughs> what? Ah, kids, what did I tell you? Stop eating sand from the litter box. Cats pee in it. Kids, what did I tell you? You'll get my explosives once you learn how to use firecrackers. <laughs> Kids. Oh, what do you mean the kids got in trouble for putting up cherry bombs into the toilet? I'm so proud! At least they were cherry bombs. <laughs> At least they're cherry bombs with the crap I'm exposed to. You know they would do something worse. I can't do Scottish accents. <laughs> the only reason why is for like, some... I can do an Australian accent. That's it. Like, I can do British, then it gets, like, all really awkward, and I can't really do many accents. I can do Russian, though. Russian is my favorite. Well, when... What do you mean they got into a fight? Wait, who won? <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like a medic. <laughs> that... No, he would be more like, who caused the most bodily damage? <laughs> Unless peak. you're Frederick, where he'd be like, what are you talking about? <laughs> no, kids, don't fight! No fighting, kids. No, 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 no. Because Frederick's a professional, like a literal professional, who quit because people thought he was insane. Children. When he's actually not insane. He's an actual doctor. <laughs> See, please note, I have a doctorate. No, it's not from the back of a cereal box. But yeah. Kids, 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 kids. What are you doing with baking soda and vinegar? Oh, they want you to make a volcano now. With baking soda and vinegar. Ugh, that's not a volcano. Goodness. You know that's not a good volcano. <laughs> okay. Do, do, do you want to play? Because I, I watched. I was so excited to do like one of these drawing videos with you. Because I saw this on a TF2 video. Do you want to do a TF2 would you rather? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, you go first. Oh, uh, why me? You first. Mm. So I can understand how far I can go. Okay, speaking of how far you can go, how far can I go? Uh, keep it YouTube friendly for the sake of I do not want to lose monetization. Uh, well, these guys said it in a YouTube video without being censored, so I think it should be okay, question mark. Okay. Um, I'm, I'm gonna use literally the one they used, because it was just so funny. <laughs> okay. Would you rather take the whole medigun needles in the left butt cheek or try to swallow the heaviest pointer finger how big's the pointer finger on him again <laughs> you can literally look up a picture you have all the files i do not have all the files you have all the files you don't have all of the files you know you have all the files you have every single one of the comic pieces How many needles are it have? How many needles are in a uh, medigun again? Thirty-two. Crap! I hate needles. <laughs> in, in the left butt cheek, just one butt cheek. Thirty-two needles, one butt cheek from the medic, or you have to try to swallow his finger. I'm taking the finger. <laughs> I have a fear of needles, man. I, I don't like needles either, but I I, I think I'm gonna go medigun, mainly because if if you think about it, if you're on the, are we on the same team though? I don't know. I think we still. Like, have... If we'd be on the same team as the medic, then it would heal. It'd become like a numbing factor. You wouldn't feel it after a while. Yeah. So I'm going medigun because I'm assuming I'm on the same team. I'm gonna t still take the. I'm gonna take the finger. I'll. I have very little gag reflex due to a, having suffering from a really bad thing. It's mm. not sexual related. It's due to suffering from massive vomiting as a child due to stress. Oh, goodness. Mm. Sorry. Yeah. Your turn. <laughs> so I'm hopefully that plays in. <laughs> hopefully, yeah. Uh, your turn. Mm, okay. 
would you rather have to clean medics bird have to clean the area where medics birds are for a whole week? No, wait for okay. no wait for six months. That escalated. Yeah, I I decided to escalate it. Or have to clean the raccoon raccoon sanctuary. Also for six months. Only using a toothbrush. On both. <laughs> I had to add the toothbrush. I had to add the toothbrush because soldier likes to spit clean. I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna go with the birdcage. Really? Yeah. Cause I I'm okay with medic being my company. <laughs> <laughs> but raccoons. <laughs> Exactly. <laughs> Trash pandas. I don't know what they're gonna do to my face. <laughs> Scratch it out. And and knowing that soldier is the one that keeps them. <laughs> Goodness. But yeah, I'm I'm going with uh I'm going with the birds. <laughs> Bless your face. <laughs> Okay. All right. I think I might also go with the birds because I'm used to chickens. <laughs> okay. Your turn. Mm, would you rather arm wrestle the heavy or race the scout? I wrestle the heavy. Anything dealing with running, I'm avoiding. Are you? Wow. He's like you. You could snap your arm. I don't care. I can't <laughs> run. <laughs> I'm gonna race the scout. <laughs> I'm not racing this guy. Okay, I'm sorry. Ladies and gentlemen, I, Cat Lunicia, cannot run. Okay? There is no way I can run. Not even if not even if Sniper was at the end of the track, naked, holding a giant cheesecake. I am not going to be able to run. <laughs> Next thing I'm drawing. <laughs> really? I will draw it, and in the cheesecake will be a sign that says you can do it. <laughs> I will sketch it out right now. <laughs> That will be our next video. <laughs> That's gonna help my YouTube ratings. Okay, uh, my turn. Would you rather eat a sandwich that has been out in the sun for a week? Okay. Okay, no, three days. I'll be nice. Okay. Or drink a whole case of Bonk Atomic Punch. <laughs> I'm going with the sandwich. <laughs> I'm going with the sandwich. <laughs> By the way, audience, if you want to answer these questions as well, please do so in the comments. I love how you went for the I sandwich. I really hope you put up pictures of what we're talking about. <laughs> yes. If you could figure that out. I'll figure something out. But yeah, I, I just love to see you try. You want to eat the sandwich. Mayonnaise. Cheese. It's disgusting, and I'll go right to the medic. <laughs> medic called me. What did you do? I ate the sandwich. They don't do this. It's been out in the sun for a week. Goodness. I'm, I'm going with the sandwich, because at least I know what's in it. <laughs> yes, you don't want the radioactive isotopes. Yes, that only the scouts seem to handle. Barely. For all I know, scout swimmers are just doing it sideways. Yeah, probably. Scout, you're infertile. Where what? are you going? Me? Oh, yeah. I, I might have to go with a sandwich as well. <laughs> <laughs> because I always had that head cannon, and it's a horrible head cannon, but I'm sticking with it. I love how you give him like a little soul patch. Well, he has. Why a... do you? He has a soul patch. Please note the soul patch. I'm sorry, I didn't know it. You didn't notice Le Soul Patch? Le Patch no, of Le Soul? No, I was looking at, like, fan art of him, not the actual pictures of him. Please no! Look what I look what I have with me. You have too many... Goodness. It's not weird. No, it's not weird, it's dedicated. It's dedicated to my craft, yo. It is. Technically it is. Um... Okay, now it's my turn. Yeah, I have, but my head cannon that deals with Scout Atomic Punch. I have a theory that Scout
Scout's Atomic Punch. T uh, the red one tastes like Mountain Dew Code Red, and the blue one tastes like the blue equivalent. <laughs> and I hate Mountain Dew, so... Take that in as you will. Mm, I'm trying to think of mine. And some of these, I'm just like, in the back of my mind, like, wow, these... If I can make these in SFM, I so would. <laughs> what? Um, would you rather have the demo man be in charge of your birthday party? Okay, this sounds fun. Or would you rather hmm hmm would you rather have the demo man throw your birthday party and be in charge of it completely? Every uh -huh. single thing. Except every little thing. Even what you wear. Oh, boy. Or. Or. Would you rather have the sniper spend the entire week with you? Uh-huh. <laughs> Hold on. Spend the entire week with you and admit that he loves you by the end of the week. Yes! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I was automatically gonna go with Demo Man with the party because I imagine that he can full, do a great... Scottish people can do a great party, especially if booze is involved, and the Irish can pull a great party as well. <laughs> but, you know... <laughs> oh, wait, no, 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 no. Let me change it up. Let me change it up. It's even better like this. <laughs> Would you rather have the Demo Man throw you a birthday party being in charge of everything, including what you wear, or... One day, look outside and see the sniper across the road, naked, holding a cheesecake. Okay, now you're- <laughs> do, do I get to eat the cheesecake? He's just walking down the road. Do, do I get to eat the cheesecake? That's- what you do is up to you. Which one are you choosing? Cheesecake! Cheesecake, 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 He couldn't even be going after you, for all you know. Oh god. Could He's just walking down the road naked with a cheesecake. <laughs> Why is he naked holding a cheesecake? You can ask him that when you get there. <laughs> <laughs> I'm still doing But you're going with Sniper? Yeah, I'm still going with Sniper. I'm sorry, Demo. Uh, I'm going demo. with Demo. I'm going with Demo. Only because you don't love Demo- you don't love Sniper like I do. No, I I'm not attracted to him like that. <sighs> Alright. Alright. Here's mine. Would you rather... Now, do you have to deal with this hell? This is hell. I'm gonna give you hell now. Good, good. You have to deal with Scout, who only sings Tom... Who has... Okay, 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 go ahead and do this. You're gonna have to hang out with Scout on a long-ass okay. road trip where he sings 20 What's New Pussycats oh my gosh. with one at number 17. No, 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 wait. Halfway through, he sings one. It's un not unusual. Oh, you've seen that video. I love the Salt and Pepper Diner bit. It's the best storytelling yeah. ever. Yeah. Basically a reenactment of Salt and Pepper Diner, only it's Scout singing it on a card ride, leading somewhere. Don't know. I can't do math to figure out how long a distance would be for 20 What's New Pussycats. Okay. And it's Scout singing the whole way. Okay. Never taking a break. Okay. Full on Scout. What's the or? <laughs> <laughs> or you have to be in a diner, the Salt and Pepper Diner. Oh gosh. Dealing with the what's the cats? Oh, Salt and Pepper Diner. On a date with the Scout, who will most likely have to sing. <laughs> <laughs> I want to see which one she would rather do with Scout singing what's new Pussycat? Am I the only two? Are we the only two in the car? <laughs> yes, you are the only one in the car with him. Oh, I'm going with the diner. <laughs> I'm going with the diner, because that means I can get up and sit next to someone else for a while. <laughs> oh, you don't want to be all or, or, like, order, like, extra food for him to shut up for a while longer. <laughs> I just want to imagine Scout just going, What's new, pussycat? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Um, I just want to... Okay. Mm, I was, was going to originally... I'm going to put you through it. Hold on. 
originally was going to say on a bus with Scout only singing Butts News Pussycat and all the mercenaries were there, but I think the mercenaries would kill after two What's New Pussycats. Oh, uh, yeah, definitely. I would be um, like, that's it? Heavy, sit on him. Oh, I get to put you through it now. Oh, Fun. no. Oh, you're making him blue. Because blue is a relaxing color. It is a relaxing color. Um, would you rather have to sit through a replay of Sniper dying? For how long? Three hours. Uh. Just on a replay, and you can't leave the room. Uh. Or... Would you, or would you rather see that the sniper is in love with someone you do not ship him with? So sniper's in love with someone else? Yeah. That isn't me? Yeah. Replay for three hours. <laughs> really? Yeah, because most likely sniper's going to get stabbed in the ass by sniper by a spy. That's like 90% of him getting killed. And I can make funny noises after like hour three. <laughs> after like 30 minutes. I can make funny anim anime noises. Okay. I, th I think you'll most likely, after the initial shock after 10 minutes, you'll start making funny noises. You know what I mean? Probably, yeah. There's like the initial shock. You make and like then it bad one-liners. Yeah, yeah, you would start making like bad one liners. Okay, it's not TF2 related, but I want to see what you would do because this is a question I gave a couple, a bunch of my other friends, and I want to see how you would go after it. Okay. But you get a million dollars every year. Okay. But every time you eat food, you hear it talk, and only you can hear it. No one else can hear it. The so food you, talk or the million dollars? You t the food talks. Okay. So every time you're about to eat, the food starts talking to you. Like, please don't eat me. Oh, my God. Please, I have a wife and kids. You know, okay. most likely begging for mercy. And if you want to add a little flavor to it, wherever the food's region is from, it has its accent. So pasta will have Italian accent. Has... Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> I just want to see where, you're, where you go on this. Okay. Since I'm going to take it for what you said it was. Is it, like, is the voice coming from the food? Yes. The f it I put in headphones while I eat, then. Ah, you still hear it. I still hear it. All right. So it's, like, in your head, you will hear it, the mouth is moving, you can hear the food talk. I mean, I think headphones are, I think you can block it out with headphones, maybe. Well, they scream if I bit into it. They scream when you bite into it, and they go, oh my god, the agony. But I have a million dollars, right? Every year you have to deal with this, yes. Is it, like, constantly? Yes. Every time you eat. Okay. Um, the food acts normal until you pick it up and you're about to eat it. I'd just scarf it down, then. <laughs> yes. Just quickly scarf it down, feel bad for, like, the first few weeks, and then just not care anymore. Yeah. That's what, uh... What one person said. I got this idea that off of Rooster Teeth, and I said it to all my friends. And one guy off Rooster Teeth would start would go, I start becoming a glutton because I start getting sadistic hearing the screams and being like, Yes, suffer! Ha ha ha! And I'm like, And we now know who the crazy one is of the group. I just more become immune to it. Yeah, I think I'd slowly become immune to it, or most likely do what you did, said headphones. Yeah. But anyway, now the. Shall I do the would you, ra would you rather now? Yes. Okay, would you rather. Have to do with body decomposition, body disposal with Miss Pauling. <laughs> okay. For a month. Okay. Or have to be undercover with Spy as your lover, but it's not a romantic love life. I'm confused by that statement. You have to pretend you're a couple, but you're not a couple that's in romance. So you're not pretending you're on your honeymoon or anything. You're pretending like, like you're... just holding hands and stuff. Yeah, well, no, 
like your disgruntled like cute platonic things like like no. subtle PDA not total PDA <laughs> no it's like you're a disgruntled unhappy couple oh you're like one of those couples that's going on vac would be going on vacation to try to mend it together but you know it's going to end in divorce later on so, you have so to I, I, I pretend to be a very pissed off wife with the spy mm -hmm. or I'd have to help Miss Pauling not get everyone arrested yeah I'd go spy, actually, because I would screw up everything if I was on this ball. <laughs> what do you- how do you not know how to cut off fingertips? No, it's, it's not the cutting off part, it's just I forget things. <laughs> what do you mean you forgot where to put the body? Y yeah, it, it's more like I forget the location if I had- if I had to split up with her. Yeah. But I think I'd mainly go with the spy because I just want to see how it goes. Yeah. And that means I can hit him whenever I want. <laughs> <laughs> when did you get that frying pan? It's gonna just slap him. Like, why'd you do that? Just cause you're you. <laughs> I hate looking at your face. You know, just because we're pretending to be a horrible, ma horrible married couple doesn't mean you have to act like it. I would totally have gone with Miss Pauling if you said we had to be in a romantic relationship. <laughs> <laughs> I was thinking about that, but then I'm like, wait, she might enjoy that. <laughs> no, I mean, I respect the spy, but I don't I feel that way. I, I couldn't remember. What, 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 what? It's like, okay, where do you fall on spy love? It's on a scale of like one to ten, or? No. All right, your turn. Let's say on a scale of one to ten with that, it's about a six. All right, your turn. Hmm. Would you rather... There are people who are watching this video most likely going to be like, oh my god, this is so boring. I'm like, shut up. Yeah, it probably is to them. Um, or it's it could be less boring if like we actually drew them out. <laughs> <laughs> Would you rather make out with this sandwich or have sex with this corpse? Wait, what? <laughs> Freud, you want to no, talk? I'm just like imagining now like the two drawings, like chibi drawings I'd actually make of me like like standing with Miss Pauling and her just looking really angry <laughs> or just us like me and the spy like at a romantic dinner table just death glaring at each other just like <laughs> yeah. it's mainly the pictures in my mind that are making me laugh yeah um, I'm imagining it as well and it is funny for some reason is. you have just thrown your drink at him it was a red wine it will stain his soup he will cry except I won't drink wine that's probably why we're not agreeing with anything. <laughs> <laughs> well, it will stain his suit and he will cry. That's the important bit. Very true. Um, but then I'd feel bad after. <laughs> and like once we get back to our room, I'd be like, I got it. Don't worry, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry, husbando. Yeah. Um, would you rather hmm, have a sleepover? Wait, hold on. Grandma yeah. needs me. Okay. Hold on, where is the microphone mute, mute button? It's somewhere around here. Ah, there it is. I'm assuming she's gone now. Hello, everyone. How are you today? For the next few minutes, there will be stars flying across the screen. Really? Along with random spies spinning to Benny Hill music. <laughs> just make my animation hell now, aren't you? No, but that'd be funny though, right? Just like, da -na 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 -na. <laughs> But alright, yeah. I'll be back too. Uh, and now, there will be drawings of half-naked Jesus. Did you just say half-naked Jesus? <laughs> no, Jesus! Okay. <laughs> Jesus is already half-naked. You see the crucifixion? Dude, he's ripped. Yes, I know, Grandma. I'm back and I have one. Mm hmm. Would you rather have a sleepover with the medic, but. He tells you that the only way he can fall asleep 
as if he can hold you, but he talks really loud in his sleep, screaming German. <laughs> <laughs> or, would you rather go on a hunting trip with the soldier, where it's normal for the first few minutes, and then he just takes off everything and covers himself in honey? The entire hunting trip, and you have to be out there with him for about a week. Wait, do I also have to cover myself in honey? Nope, just him. Just him being completely ambitious about you being there. Arm around you and everything. Naked, covered in honey. <laughs> He's threw up for that honey. For a week. And how many, How often do I have to sleep with my dick? For a week. I mean, I've fallen asleep with loud YouTube videos on. Like, he's screaming German, like those old documentaries, screaming German, but he never seems to notice. The gif off is still happening, I see. I think it is. Nope, it stopped. <laughs> you won! Um, um, I can't believe I'm saying this. Naked soldier. Why? <laughs> I don't think I can have- I mean, I can sleep with the loud YouTube videos. I can, I have done it. But I don't think I could handle loud screaming German. <laughs> okay. Also, because now I have potential to have pictures of said naked soldier and use it as blackmail. To be like, you made me have to deal with this. I want money back. I- 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 I have a favor now. Okay. My turn! Okay. You have to now babysit whatever potential spawn Zana and Heavy have. Z Zana? Not Zana and Heavy. Ew, that's Eagle Eagle. Zana and Soldier okay. have. You have to babysit all the spawn. All of them. And knowing how frequently romantic they get, they're gonna have a lot of kids. It's gonna be Weasley family up in there. Okay. Or... Crap, I had the other option. Or, you have to go on a cruise. A cruise dedicated to families. With Scout. Who is really Scout. Yeah. Scout. Yeah. I'd go with Scout. What? I hate babies. <laughs> I don't like them and they don't like me. Okay. Aww. But okay. I, mean, I don't mind children. It's just I prefer to deal with either my own age or older. Children, where did you come from? Our mothers! Shut up! But yeah, no, I'd probably want to. I'd, I'd actually want to see the scout family because I want to see how that's going. I'd be. I would. I would want to be moral support for the scout. No, 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 no. Not. No, no, no. You're going on a cruise that's originally meant for families. Yeah. But no, no, no. Like a Disney cruise. Yeah. But Scout took you on the brain's mindset that it's a cruise for romantic couples. When did that change? <laughs> because I'm okay. Evil. Um, still scout. I'd still scout. Yeah, I'd still scout. Because Disney cause cruises are fun. I've never been on one. <laughs> um, money, but um. Same. No, because then like he'd get really sad because his brothers are making fun of him, and I'd be like, "It's okay, scout. I still like you." <laughs> and then you could pretend to be his girlfriend. <laughs> Does he think it's serious? <laughs> I don't know. Let's roll initiative to see how dumb Scout is. Get a dice. Um, I think I have a D6 somewhere in the other room. <laughs> Do you want me to go try and find it? <laughs> no, no, no. I can literally go and try to find it. No, please, no. Hold on, I'll be back. Ah! Hold on, you're gonna hear me yelling? Yes. Dark in this room. And lights on. Hi, DJ. D6. Six, where I put the dice. I 
I've been abandoned again. I lied! I knew it! I threw them away! You horrible person! Hold on, I can get a random dice roller off the internet. All hell, random dice rollers off the internet. Okay. <laughs> Roll to see if Scout is that stupid! What, did I, what does that have to be? Like, I, what in higher? I think that's an intelligence saving throw. We don't know his intelligence. <laughs> Scout, how intelligent are you? Uh, do you think tomatoes are a fruit? They're a vegetable. But no, um, dice roller, random <laughs> dice roller. Okay. Um, let's roll one die. Okay. If it's a what in like a five or higher, he knows. If it's a five and below, he doesn't know. <laughs> and <laughs> he got a one. <laughs> Scout doesn't even know how to tie his shoes. They are no, belt intelligence. He he seriously thought it was a romantic cruise. <laughs> uh... <laughs> Poor Scout. Anyway. Oh, my uh, turn. Poor Scooty Scoot. Would you rather... Hmm. Have to share a suit with the spy? Right, us. Mr. Lanky for... Tall and lanky versus short and squat. <laughs> like, sharing the suit. Like, a get-along t-shirt. It's big enough. Ugh. For five hours, or oh, would you rather? Or have to? I forgot her name. Zana. Yeah, or you would have to date Zana. I'm going on a date with Zana. <laughs> I'm sorry, spy smokes. And knowing this. It's a stressful situation, therefore he's going to smoke more, and my asthmatic butt doesn't want to deal with that. Alright. Would you rather... Okay, we're gonna make this fun. Would you rather have to deal with Mara help Marasmus on Halloween in his most likely very unsuccessful venture, or... <laughs> Fight the Japanese Mafia. No, um... Uh... Or... Have to help Old Nick on Christmas. You forgot who Old Nick was, didn't you? I don't even know who he is. Oh my god, read a cr freaking comic! I haven't been able to the last week and a half. Uh, I got this! Oh goodness. Audience, don't judge me. Sometime later. <laughs> Did you learn anything? Um, I'd rather help Marasmus. <laughs> <laughs> just cut all like that story out and just go like, I'd rather help Marasmus. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we'll just have another uh, technical difficulties. <laughs> but yeah, but you'd learn. Spy is a good dad. Spy is a scary good dad. Scary as in it's scary how good he is, or scary because of his creepy ways of teaching how to be a good Both. Uh -huh. Don't make me start liking Spy, dang it. Love him! <laughs> he pulled a picture of Abby. <laughs> Rug love! <laughs> That's a rough... Love him, Abby. I like him already. Um, hold on. What are you doing? I'm gonna find the one picture that makes everybody cry. Is it heavy holding medic? Not that one. <laughs> well, it's one of them, but. Oh, there's there's naked soldier. Ah. Uh... Naked honey covered soldier. And oh, it's Scout dead. Booyah! Cry! Why? <laughs> <laughs> Why? Why is this? People compare this to like the ma to Mary holding baby Jesus after he got.
baby Jesus, grown up Jesus, after he got crucified. I'm like, I can see the art comparisons. Goodness. Okay. No, no, stop it. I don't want to like spy. Moving on. Sedusni. <laughs> <laughs> the worst time to say that. What? The worst time. Why? <laughs> just go back to that scene for a moment. All right. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Just, just imagine. Just imagine this. Him, like, all sad because his possible son died. It is his son. He admitted to it. His son died. And his head just turns up to the camera slowly. Zooms up. His eyes half closed like that smirk on his face. So just me. me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> With his dead son in his arms. Gotta find, gotta find a seduce me gift now. Crap! Seduce me. <laughs> I am a woman. I am not one of your fried chicken tramps. I am a woman. I like my men dangerous, mysterious. You want to be my lover? Seduce me. Seduce me. <laughs> I still love expiration. Dates. You know, I'm I'm going back on the thing that we were talking about, like the uh, would you rather the whole spy situation. Uh huh. Oh, you're going back? No, I'm not. I'm just thinking on that, like, goodness. I feel like I'd be spy in that situation. Minus the seduce me part. <laughs> Being literally the I am a woman kind of part. <laughs> I don't know. Anyway. I'm just trying to imagine you being like, I am a... I, I just imagined Sammy doing that to Sniper. Like, I am a woman. I like my man dangerous, mysterious. You want to be my lover? Seduce me! And then just Sniper just stands in the corner going, I'm all those things. <laughs> <laughs> and I already seduced you. Why are y'all throwing me? Get I just dead. realized. Was he talking about the pyro? What? <laughs> Spy in that moment. Dangerous, mysterious. <laughs> ah. Spy is something we don't. <laughs> Spy knows something. Spy, what do you know? Seduce me. I just like to imagine that Sabby does that to Sniper, and Sniper's like, we're already in bed. Naked eating cheesecake. What more do you want? <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> Why are they naked eating cheesecake? No one knows. Oh, I love all the pastels. They're so pretty. Oh, boy, you're just gonna... Pastels are my favorite. Really? I couldn't mm -hmm. have told. Indeed, you couldn't have told. Because English is not my language. <laughs> I speak American. Oh, goodness. Anyway. <laughs> so, um, audience, whose turn is it for Would You Rathers? I think I'm good on Would You Rathers. <laughs> Because I'm traumatizing you again? No, I'm trying to think. I'm trying not to talk about headcanons. Or like, what if my character, so to speak, kind of moments. So I'm just kind of like, hmm. <laughs> what if Sniper had a mustache? No. Mm -mm. That'd just be weird. Mustache. I mean, if you like that, sure. To me, no. Uh, I mean, no, but I'm just saying. I don't like mustaches. Beards? Monocles. Sort of. Not really. Top hats. Sure. <laughs> Look, Archimedes is wearing a top hat. <laughs> nope. What? Can't leave what? that in my head. You got that in your head now? No, it's... You said, Look, Archimedes in a top hat and Spy just popped in my mind. Have I just spoiled you with spy goodness? No, just what, like, we were screaming a minute ago. <laughs> Seduce me! Like, that's all I imagine from Archimedes screaming. <laughs> Seduce me! <laughs> How awkward would the medic feel if, like, Archimedes just flew up to him and said that? I think medic would be throwing holy water at him, going, The power of Christ compels you! <laughs> Despite me just having a deal with the devil. <laughs> what? Despite me what? Hmm? What did you say? 
Oh, I said, despite me signing a deal with the devil. <laughs> despite that, the power of Christ compels you. That's right. That explains it. Hold did, on. I put the other, did, I, did I fold them all already? This explains oh no, I did. This explains everything. Hold on. What? One second. I'm confused. I'm going to explain a thing. This involves this... magic and pie. Entertain the audience while I eat pie. I'm making more stars. <laughs> Many stars. I will fill. I will fill this jar by the end of the week. Look, spy. Okay. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Okay, can you get like Archimedes for spy? What? Can you get like Archimedes for the spy? No. Well, I mean, yes, you could, but in SFM, I could, but it takes a lot of finagling. Ah. Uh. Sorry for the noise. Oh yeah, that lovely sound of ripping paper. Hold on, I'll mute myself. Blueberry pie is very fattening. I'm back. Are you done ripping paper and hurting my ears? Yes. Okay. This is the last batch I make tonight. Okay, you know, never mind that theory I had. The game theory's dead. Okay. Ignore my theory, everybody. Sniper is a medic. Yes. What are you snacking on? What? Nothing. I drank my tea Ooh. and then went. What flavor is it? It's uh, Tazo black tea. Look at him, he looks so happy. He does. Didn't even notice it was my drawing when I looked up at it. Is it that obvious? What? I don't know. I don't know. That birds sing. Yes. <laughs> I got nothing here, shut up. Okay. Don't worry, the next drawing we're gonna do is spy crabs with maracas. Oh goodness, I will draw like the most kawaii desune. <laughs> I can draw spy. Sp I can draw spy crab. Sweet. I mean, it's not that hard to draw spy crab. Yeah. It's literally three circles with legs. Oi! It is more than three circles with legs. There's three circles with legs with minor detail. <laughs> There's heart, there's soul, there's passion, there's donuts. There's maracas. I'm sorry. Five circles. <laughs> Six circles. And now I'm going to add some extra effects. Look at the extra effect. Oh my god, glitter. <laughs> I wasn't expecting the glitter, also I put a glitter jar right next to him. Oh, it's just paper. Okay. The paper sparkles. I was gonna put a paper texture on it, but I was like, no. Sparkles. Now, like the tangled music is going in my head. Which tangled Luther music? Luther likes interior design. design. <laughs> and I, I had this weird head cat. Cause see the weird he head 
music video once because someone compared the design of a uh, Miss Pauling's model because of those big green eyes she has to uh, Rapunzel's model because she also has big green eyes. Yeah. Oh yeah, Miss Miss Pauling is like the only one with not blue eyes besides the demo, right? Yeah. And then I, someone compared the, compared her to uh, Rapunzel, and then I just had this weird brain fart of think imagining her going into a uh, tavern where the Mercs are and singing "I, I Have want, a Dream." I want that as a video. All the Mercs just singing "I Have a Dream," and it's just Scout being Ryder. Yes, <laughs> Scout is Ryder. He's like to be on an island of piles of money, surrounded by enormous piles of money. Piles of money. I have a dream. Oh, I have a, a dream. <laughs> I just want to see the glowing lantern screen. I just don't want to clean up after dead bodies. <laughs> and every passing hour, I'm so glad I left my tower. Like everybody else, I've got a dream. <laughs> every passing hour, I'm so glad I left you for it. <laughs> <laughs> I love the administrator. <laughs> I actually I had like mercenaries like each the different mercenary was a different uh I have a dream yeah and like the one who did sewing was medic and I'm just heavy collected goodness. ceramic unicorns unicorns that's all thinking <laughs> but and like heavy co and Misha collects ceramic unicorns. Unicorn. Or I, pyro I collected ceramic for, though, um, Gunther does interior design because of this. Who does the interior design? Demo. Or, I think Spy, Spy wishes to be a mime. No, Spy does not wish to be a mime. <laughs> Bruiser knits. Little pu Pyro does little puppet shows and heavy collects oh, ceramic Pyro's you. little puppet shows. That's so cute. <laughs> oh, Pyro wants to be a mime because he doesn't talk. <gasps> that makes sense. But Pyro. Ooh, wants wow. to be <laughs> Who would be like leaning up, like the administrator is leaning in with the glare? <laughs> now I'm just thinking of that song with TF2 version. Dude. We need to work on this. Well, if I do, like, because at my school, if I'm able to get the program, my animation program, <laughs> I could technically do that. <laughs> we'll just I could make that my final. <laughs> yes. We'll just need some people to sing. Who wants to be Pauling? <laughs> I mean, I can do Pauling. We'll need all the mercenaries. Goodness. We what? have started something that will never be finished, but we will no. always talk about. <laughs> yes. We'll write songs about it. This reminds me of, like, I, I was in a uh, live stream with, I wasn't in it, but I was watching it of my one of my favorite YouTubers, besides you, um, Aww. where I, I've, like, been watching this guy for 10 years. Like, he's he was literally, like, one of my first YouTubers I ever learned about. Uh-huh. He, 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 by the way, Senpai noticed me. He likes my art style. Um, but no, like, he was really busy. He, he does knife runs of Resident Evil games. And he was having some difficulty with this one guy. And the entire time I started this in the chat, in the chat, we were trying to think of a Resident Evil themed song of making my way downtown. Like we were remaking the entire song while he was fighting and he had no idea. Making my way downtown, fucking fast, zombies pass, and we're running out of here. Yeah, pretty much. And I miss, need you, da 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 da. And, I miss and now I wonder if Wesker okay, right. could stop being an asshole. If Wesker could die heroically. Could I also have cheesecake? I want cheesecake now. I have blueberry pie. Goodness. You and cheesecake. Well, you started it. Technically, you did. Yeah, well, I wanted to, I needed a goal that I would definitely run for, and cheesecake is a thing I run for. Not, ooh, ooh, not, not, not the sniper? Well, the sniper, yes, but cheesecake is no, an extra No, 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 you just go for the cheesecake. No, 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 well, 
Cheesecake is the realistic thing. Sniper is the other thing. You don't know. Go to cos go to go to conventions. I don't think there are sniper cosplayers that are willing to date me. I will actually want to set up a photo shoot for TF2 one day. I would like to one day set up a giant chicken. Okay. <laughs> All I want to do is see you turn into a giant chicken. A giant chicken. Giant woman. What I would kill for is to find cosplayers of Steven Universe. This is my dark dream. Let me have it. Where I can find people who can turn into a few, who could, you know, the parts of the fusion and then the actual cosplay of the fusion. And just do like a weird video thing where they do the fusion dance and then pop the fusion. But like, you know how hard it is to find the people? Very hard. I, don't, I, I, I know that's really hard. I wasn't in a Steven Universe, actually. I just got into it only a month ago. It's okay. We'll get you into it deeper. Until, like, I realized literally everyone I knew wanted me to be Rose Quartz. Well, you're pretty. I think it's more like the body type. You have boobs. Yeah, which is also the reason why everyone in the Orleans community want me to be Mad Moxie. Everyone wanted me to be her daughter because I'm fat, but still. <laughs> What is it, phone? Why are you messaging me? I am not going to play video games right now. No, I do not wish to know that there are games on sale. Will I get to s watch you do SFM after this? Fine, we can do SFM. You figure out fun something funny to do. <sighs> it's her drug. I pay her in this. <laughs> SFM. The anti-drug. It's great. I don't have it, so... <laughs> Mac user. Hey, if I could have a PC instead of a Mac, I totally would. All I want to do is see you have a freaking PC! A freaking PC! All I want to do is completely use SFM. Oh my god, are you putting glitter on him? No, I'm hiding a hole I made. Okay. There's a I hole. put glitter on his fingers. It's like a tiny detail. <gasps> tiny detail! Na na na! Na na na! Na na na! Na na na! Ack! I'll fix this in a second. Don't worry. Does that look right? There we go. One more, one more star to make. Is that right? Yee. Yeah. It's like, wow, a tiny detail that no one's going to notice. Yep. People are like, you are the queen of tiny details that no one notices. Yep. Yep. And now for the fir for the final touch. More glitter! Oh goodness, the glitter. Hey, I don't get to do glitter in my art anymore because of my the people who I work for. They want hard and edgy and manly, and I'm like, glitter sparkles pretty. I miss doing pretty things. And last star for tonight. Yes. I'm almost to the top of this jar. Soon she will be the queen of the jungle. All right then. Oh, that's cute. I'm Tetsu anime now. <laughs> People are going to be like, "Okay, calm down. We get it. You're suffering from a lack of sparkle in your life, but you can calm down." Oh my gosh, no. Oh my god. Is that better? <laughs> no? Okay, I'll, I'll, I'll delete it. I don't mind it. <laughs> <laughs> I miss doing sparkles, okay? I never get to do them. That's fine. It's okay. Eh, eh, more sparkle. More sparkle. Sparkle everywhere. Sparkle. 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 <sighs> eh, 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 eh. 
Hello, my name is Kat. I am a sparkle addict. I am not a sparkle addict! <laughs> Just want to make him look make happy. Him look happy. He is happy. <laughs> I'm making him happier. Sparkle! Oops. And now, mm -hmm. we are done. What about your emblem? I'll put it on after the video. Okay. 